Hello students. Today we will discuss about the general account of elasmobranchi and holocephali. These are two groups of chondrichthys. First of all, uh, elasmobranchi. The name elasmobranchi represents any numerous uh, uh, of uh, numerous cartilage which is which have open gills or without gill cover. Elasmobranchi is made up of two terms, elasmo and branchi. Elasmo means open or without covering and branchi means gills. Which I have, the fishes which I have no gill cover or no operculum on the gills. Having uh, uh, 5 to 7 gills uh, slits on each side, they, they have a spiracle behind each eye uh, present in the elasmobranchi. Pectoral fins of elasmobranchi are greatly enlarged. Elasmobranchs refer to the cartilaginous fish a family of shark, rays and skates. Their upper jaw are also fused with their skull and instead of repressible rows of teeth, they have three pairs of large grinding tooth plates. Uh, therefore, they have hyostylic jaw suspension. They usually live in the deep ocean, ocean bed or deep sea. This is the geological time scale in which Devonian period, they, it is uh, presumed that uh, cartilaginous species originated from the Devonian period. Devonian period is also known as the age of fish. This is the uh, age of fish from where Devonian period, from where the fishes are originated in this line. And uh, these are the various type of sharks. They have various type of tail, various type of scales, various type of colors, various type of size, shape and etc. In the ocean. Elasmobranchs are renowned for their highly tuned senses which make them incredibly successful in their environment. Their senses of smell is very sensitive and most species have large nostrils that allow a large volume of water to flow continuously over their olfactory organs. ऐसा माना जाता है कि शार्क ही ऐसी मछलियां हैं ऐसी एनिमल हैं जो अपने एनवायरनमेंट के लिए सर्वाधिक अनुकूलित हैं सबसे ज्यादा अनुकूल एनिमल पाया जाता है मोस्टली एडेप्टेड एनिमल्स हैं सरप्राइजिंग सरप्राइजिंगली हियरिंग इज आल्सो अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट सेंस टू एलास्मोब्रेंक्स एंड दे हैव वेल डेवलप्ड इंटरनल इयर्स इन फॉर्म ऑफ टू टिनी होल्स बिहाइंड आईज हियरिंग इज ऑफन अ फर्स्ट सेंस टू डिटेक्ट प्रे एट लॉन्ग डिस्टेंस सुन करके भी वो अपनी शिकार को पहचान लेती हैं, देख करके भी पहचान लेती हैं, सुन करके भी पहचान लेती हैं। यानी देखने का सुनने का और सुनने का जो सेंसेस हैं, वो सरप्राइजिंगली आश्चर्यजनक रूप से बहुत ही अच्छे पाए जाते हैं इनके अंदर इट इज यूज टू इन कंजक्शन विद स्पेशल सेंसरी ऑर्गन कॉल लेटरलाइन सिस्टम विद विच इज ए रियो रिसेप्टर ऑर्गन इन दैम उनके अंदर एक धारा प्रवाही या धारा सलाइन और धारा प्रवाही Organs, sensitive organs, uh, later line system पाए जाता है. These detect changes in water pressure, जो कि पानी के दाब को सहन कर बताता है. Around their snout and mouth are the most special sense organs are known as ampulla florengini, which detect electric field given off by prey. शिकार के द्वारा छोड़े गए इलेक्ट्रिक फील्ड को बताने के लिए एम्पुल ऑफ लॉरेंजी नहीं पाए जाते हैं उनके स्नाउट रीजन पर क्योंकि उनका माउथ स्नाउट लंबा होता है और माउथ उनके पीछे की तरफ वेंट्रल साइड में होता है अर्धचंद्रा का और स्नाउट रीजन काफी आगे तक होता है और उनका जो माउथ है वो बहुत पीछे होता है इस प्रकार से उसके स्नाउट रीजन पर एम्पुल ऑफ लॉरेंजी नहीं पाए जाते हैं मैनी शार्क ऑल्सो हैव वेरी गुड आई and uh, a great white shark can even see when its head is out of water uska pani jab sir uska pani se upar hota hai tab bhi wo pani ke andar apne shikar ko dekh leti hai great white shark usme vision ki adbhut kshamta pai jati hai when combined all these senses make lasmo branch extremely good hunter and help explain how they have managed to survive for 400 million years ye sari cheeze hain ye batane ke liye kafi hain ki 400 मिलियन साल से ये शार्क किस प्रकार से जीवित हैं इस धरती पर एक शार्क का एक डॉग शार्क का एक चित्र है जिसके एक ड्राइंग है जिसको डॉग शार्क इसलिए कहते हैं कि इसमें सूंघने की क्षमता अद्भुत पाई जाती है ये भी एक डॉग डॉग शार्क का एक चित्र है 
all elastomeric can like bony fish practice internal fertilization even reproduction internal fertilization that is important thing uh, this is more advanced character found in the less advanced species than bony fishes all uh, all uh, cartilage species all elastomeric are unisexual female shark have no obvious external reproductive structure whilst the male have two extensions of pelvic fin known as claspers claspers are used into the uh, during the copulation and which have, which are used by males during the copulation thus the fertilization is internal some sharks and all skates lay eggs in case of a seabed and wrapped around the seabed some special adaptations first one is the the rough skin which is characteristic feature of this group is due to the covering of hard tooth like plate uh, placoid scales called as dermal tentacles these vary in shape and size according to the species and help reduce drag and resistance in the water and these are the percentage of uh, racial percentage of all type of sharks into the total percentage of fish second one is the shark teeth are highly adapted for the type of prey that the particular species eat for example the starry mouth hound mr asterius is crab hunter therefore it has a um, crushing type of teeth instead the pored beagle uh, pored beagle shark only eat fish therefore it has long sharp pointed teeth that are ideal for piercing and catching the prey the blantos blantos and six gill shark is a deep sea shark that has a wide variety of prey species and probably just an opportunistic feeder they eat mollusk crustacean and also fishes therefore they have serrated cutting teeth so that they can tear anything they find for food this uh, this these are the elasmobranchs now come the holocephali the second category second subclass is the holocephali holocephali holo means entire cephali means head entire head is covered with the uh, scales is called holocephali holocephali is a taxon uh, taxon of cartilaginous species in class of chondrichthyes earliest fossils are of tooth and come from the devonian period little is a little is known about these primitive forms and only surviving groups in the subclass is is the order of chimeriformes these groups include the rat fish or the chimera and the elephant fish calorynchus these fishes move by the using sweeping movement of their large pectoral fins they have long slender tail uh, rat like tail a tapering slender like long tail live close to the seabed feeding on benthic invertebrates this is a chimera or rat fish or rabbit fish which have a rat like tail tapering rat like slender tail these are the claspers and the modification of pelvic fin fin rays these are the later line system and pectoral fins and this is a head with a, a cephalic head entire head is uh, combined with the uh, snout and between the trunk and this is the ventral mouth members of this taxon holocephali preserve today some features of elasmobranch life in the paleozoic time so in the other aspect they are evident they live close to the bottom and feed on mollusk and other invertebrates tail is moved by the sweeping movement of the large pectoral fins the erectile spine in front of dorsal fin is sometimes poisonous there is no stomach the gut is simplified and stomach is merged with the intestine and the mouth is a small aperture surrounded by lips giving a parrot like appearance the only surviving members of group of this group are uh, the rabbit fish chimera and the elephant fish calorynchus now origin and evolution of holocephali how they are originated on this earth the fossil record of the holocephali starts during the devonian period the record is extensive but most fossils are teeth and uh, body forms of numerous species are not known some experts accept that the chimeri forms originated from the palatodontiformes or inuyptiformes 
और यूजीनियो डोंटिया इन टू द टैक्स ऑन पैरासेलेक्मोरफा हाउ एवर एज ऑलमोस्ट ऑल मेंबर्स ऑफ पैरासेलेक्मोरफा आर पुअरली अंडरस्टूड मोस्ट एक्सपर्ट सस्पेक्ट दैट दिस टैक्स ऑन टू बी आइदर पैराफाइलेटिक टैक्स ऑन दिस इज ऑल अबाउट इलास्मो ब्रेंकी एंड हुई थैंक यू थैंक यू वेरी मच